that hi guys so let's start the next episode of 5 mcqs in 5 minutes through which we are actually revising all the high yield topics that had been asked previously now we are also using question from neat pg inict and fmg this series is important for all these three examination the very first question is about a patient coming from assan diagnosed with malaria was on artesunate this drug act by now don't you think a similar kind of question i have already given in around the previous episode around 17 18 18 year 19 episode maine diya hua hai hai na where uh, they have asked that how will you treat this time what they have given that okay he has already been treated drug of choice they have given already what's the mechanism of action similar topic same you uh, know different type of question so again artesunate is a drug that is derived from tcm what is tcm traditional chinese medicine and you all know that chinese are very free people hai na aur unke freedom ke liye main bar bar class mein bolta hu unke freedom ki wajah se we have lost two hour two years of our life like hai na with the covid we have seen already to unke freedom se yaad karna hai traditional chinese medicine they are the free radical generation that is toxic for the parasite parasitic heme polymerase inhibitor so heme is uh, looking like a blood right heme word look sounding like a blood so main bolta hu ki jo long mcq hote hai na wo heme aapke blood ko jalate hain long mcq khun jala dete hain these are the uh, this is the mnemonic to remember heme polymerase inhibitor that is going to be drugs like your lumifantry lumifantry we have drugs like your mefloquine lumifantry mefloquine chloroquine and quinine long mcq aapka khun jala dete hain right gametocytic drug are going to be primaquine and there is one more tough drug by the name of tafenoquine this uh, gametocytic drug that we know primaquine tafenoquine they are mainly utilized for radical cure radical cure is utilized again in examiner ask in which type of parasite so in vivax and oval will be needing a radical cure right you have seen multiple information from this slide let's see the next question which of the following agent is one of the interleukin 6 receptor antagonist so this question has been asked already in neat pg interleukin 6 and very fondly i ask you to remember as well by the very simple way hai na interleukin 6 will be tocilizumab tocilizumab ko aap kaise yaad kariye tocilizumab read like this tocilizumab sir ne bola tha tocilizumab nahi hai iska naam tocilizumab hai hai na tocilizumab there is one more by the name of serilumab serilumab it's one of the fully human monoclonal antibody serilumab s for 6 secukinumab it's one of the interleukin 7 antagonist 17 that can be mainly utilized in chronic plaque psoriasis chronic plaque psoriasis mein hum isko utilize kar sakte hain right daclizumab it's uh, uh, eldest leukin also can be utilized in psoriasis uh, daclizumab that we have is interleukin 2 uh, daclizumab there is one more by the name of your basiliximab daxi you know basiliximab interleukin 2 uh, antagonist interleukin 2 antagonist d for do and b is the second letter daclizumab and basiliximab daclizumab and basiliximab okay next one which of the following agent is used for the reversal of rivaroxaban toxicity you know what is rivaroxaban look at the name 10 ap ban lagane wale drug ye kya rivaroxaban 10 ap ban lagane wale drug rivaroxaban then we are also having apixaban ye bhi 10 ap ban lagane wale drug hai rivaroxaban apixaban they are all 10 a inhibitor and if there is overdose of 10 a then we have to neutralize it and for the neutralizing antidote neutralizing antidote that we know is known as your एंडिक्सानेट अल्फा तो उसके नाम में देखिए टेन ए को न्यूट्रलाइज करने वाला ट्रक है टेन ए को न्यूट्रलाइज करने वाला ट्रक फ्रेश फ्रोजन प्लाज्मा कैन बी यूटिलाइज मेनली इन वारफोरिन टॉक्सिसिटी इन वारफोरिन टॉक्सिटी कैन यूटिलाइज इदारू सीजुमैप इदारू सीजुमैप इट इज यूटिलाइज इन डेबीगेट्रन टॉक्सिटी डेबीगेट्रन क्या होता है डेबीगेट्रन डायरेक्टली एक्टिंग ओरल है ना थ्रॉम्बिन इनिबिटर डेबीगेट्रन डायरेक्टली thrombin antagonist this is the only one that is oral thrombin inhibitor all other iske group mein jitne hain sab injectable hai to idarucizumab to bolta hu kaise yaad karu daba ke daru protamine sulfase is antidote for your all time favorite all of you guys are already aware heparin okay one thing that i am telling you streptokinase ka agar aa jaye to epsilon amino caproic acid or we can alternatively also utilize tranexamic acid tranexamic acid jo pause or ya tranexa ke naam se aata hai right last question for the uh, second last antimicrobial which also possess mao inhibiting property mao inhibiting property is seen with antimicrobial by the name of linezolid linezolid they are associated actually you know because they are having mao inhibiting property they are associated with serotonin syndrome isliye koi other patient jo ki mao inhibitor pe hai we should always try to give this very very uh, you know with uh, much precaution and uh, plus they are also associated with peripheral neuropathy and rarely they can also lead to optic uh, neuropathy as well and they more commonly causes bone marrow suppression 
सप्रेशन वेरी वेरी कॉमनली बोन मैरो सप्रेशन वेरी वेरी कॉमनली दे विल बी कॉजिंग और उसमें भी सबसे कॉमन दे विल बी कॉजिंग डिक्रीज इन द प्लेटेड काउंट सो आफ्टर स्टार्टिंग लिनेजोलिट आफ्टर सेवन टू टेन डेज इज देर इज डिक्रीज इन द प्लेटेड काउंट थिंक अबाउट लिनेजोलिट मीडिएटेड बोन मैरो सप्रेशन इज स्टार्टेड ऑलरेडी बोन मैरो सप्रेशन में सारे काउंट्स कम होंगे बट सबसे पहले सबसे कॉमनली जो होगा दैट इज गोइंग टू बीर डिक्रीज इन द प्लेटेड काउंट पॉलीमेक्सिन इज अ सेल मेम्ब्रेन इनहिबिटर दैट इज यूटिलाइज्ड इन द सीरियस आईसीयू केसेस स्ट्रेप्टोमाइसिन इज वन ऑफ द अमाइनो ग्लाइकोसाइड बेसिट्रासिन इज वन ऑफ द सेल वॉल इनहिबिटर राइट करेक्ट आंसर फॉर दिस वन इज आई मीन स्ट्रेप्टोमाइसिन इज एसोसिएटेड विद द नेफ्रोटॉक्सिटी ऑटोटॉक्सिटी है ना नेफ्रोटॉक्सिसिटी इज आल्सो सीन विद बेसिट्रासिन दैट इज वाइज इसका सिस्टमिक यूज ज्यादा प्रेफर नहीं करते हैं Last question for the day is which of the following recently approved drug for hypoactive sexual desire in female? Hypoactive sexual desire in female, female ke libido ko increase karta hai. Flibanserin, flibanserin, it's one of the five ST one A ka, five ST one A ka agonist hai, and it is five ST two ka antagonist hai. कैसे याद किया आपने फीमेल के लिबिडो को इंक्रीज करने वाला ड्रग फीमेल के लिबिडो को इंक्रीज करने वाला ड्रग दैट इज फ्लिबानसेरिन कार्टानसेरिन डिटानसेरिन दिस इज गोइंग टू बी योर 5ST 2A by 2C antagonist that can be utilized in peripheral vascular diseases it can be utilized also in resistant cases of hypertension lower carcerin jo aapke body ko load ko kam kar de hai na body ke load ko kam kar de they are actually 5ST 2A ka agonist 5ST 2A 5ST 2 ka agonist lower carcerin load ko kam karta hai body ke load kam kar karta hai so we are mainly going to use them they are mainly going to use them in obesity we are mainly going to use them in obesity obesity mein load ko kam karta that is obesity hai na these are some important autocoid wale chapter se jo drug hai wo bhi important hai hai na so this was five important topics for all of you guys in just 5 to 6 minute that i wanted to summarize i hope all of you guys are enjoying this series and i'll be needing all your uh, you know uh, best wishes and i would like to continue this series let me know in the comment section how did you like and how you are liking this series anything else that you want for, uh, no uh, for me to record for all of you guys i'll be more than happy to help all of you guys and please don't forget to share with your friends so that they can also continue to uh, learn i'll see you in the next class thank you very much mm -hmm.